you can hear me. Is that your new tape? Star-Lord. Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd... Tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> oh! Peter! We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Maybe I can convince Annie to buy it with his paper out money. We'll make our stand. Don't give a damn. This is our time to go for tea. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. I gotta beat Janie's high score. This is embarrassing. Three natural ones in a row last game? Some bard I turned out to be. It's pretty crazy that all that destruction started from one little mistake. Need to build up my calluses. Oh man, traveling through space must be amazing. Hope Mom wasn't joking about seeing Star-Lord. Yeah, if they ever decide to play out here in the boonies. Black and white, day and night. The wheel turns round and round. Who's a winner, saint and sinner. Never know what'll come. The final battle was awesome. Looked like the heroes were done for, but they pulled it off. I 
believe I caught this. That maiden show was awesome. That's what you get with a space truck and no man. Love to be able to ride one of those light cycles. Ooh. Might as well just peel the stickers off and put them in the right spot. Fingers are still crap from trying to bookmark pages. I know it's not how you're supposed to play, but I'm tired of dying everywhere. The movie was okay. The soundtrack really kicked butt. Keep hitting those dingers, George, and you'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. That's what you get with a space truck and no man. Bit of good, a bit of bad. A bit of good, a bit of bad, yeah. Love them hard and leave them fast. That's what you get with a Peter Quill, Quill, Quill. Peter Quill, wake up. Holy crap, Drax. You gotta stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The Betrayer is ready to begin our mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her. We'll try. We're supposed to be a team. I make no promises. Oh, it ain't just a junkyard. The quarantine zone's the biggest pile of galactic war debris in the known universe. Just think of all the tech we can find. I am Groot. Hey, it's only illegal if Novacor finds us inside, which they won't. Groot's right to be nervous, Rocket. Don't underestimate the Novacor. Oh, come on. Am I the only one who ain't scared of the galactic police? They've got the numbers on us. But they ain't got the brains. Ha! I am Groot. Sure takes a genius to catch my ship. My ship? Who said that? Quill! I am Groot. No, I, I think I heard him. Nah, never mind. Nice. Rocket finally cleaned up the fur balls. You're welcome.
This moment of quiet reminds me of the legendary siege of Seknar 7. Oh, not again. It is said that Lady Hellbender held her breath through ten moons while riding across the stars on the back of a great horn beast. And when she when arrived... When she arrived, she exhaled, and the wind blew away the Shatari. Indeed, it did. I am Groot. If he realized it didn't make no sense, he wouldn't be telling it. Rocket! Why are the array cables everywhere on the floor? I'm working on it! <sighs> Peter Quill, we must soon discuss the status of my official team membership badge. Drax! Once again, there is no official badge! <laughs> Obviously, you would not have one, Assassin. The small one indicated the procedure is a well-guarded secret. Rocket, stop messing with him. Ah, there you are, Quill. Tell Groot to stop worrying about getting arrested. I am Groot. I'm not overconfident. I'm just the right level of confident. <laughs> arrested? For what? Huh. Our ship just accidentally slipped into the quarantine zone. Oops, our navigation malfunctioned. Oops. How would we accidentally cross into the Nova Corps force field? Details! <laughs> Nice gizmos, Rocket. I'm calling them thumpers on account of the noise they make. Assuming we get past the force field and reach your coordinates in one piece, all we gotta do is set them up, and these babies are gonna draw out our monster in no time. <laughs> How's that even gonna work? The thumper goes beep, 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 and the monsters come running? Eh, it goes more like, uh, wah! 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 Stop this ruckus at once! <laughs> and then the monster comes a running out of its hole. Are you sure about that? Hey, all my intel came from your source. My sources are very reliable. Those coordinates are 100% pointing towards a rare, elusive, priceless creature. With no physical description to go by. What do you think elusive means? It don't matter what the monster looks like. As long as it's got ears, you could be sure my thumpers are gonna drive it right into our arms. Rocket! Did you bring back the docking chips you took from the alignment console? I'll do it as soon as I reconfigure them! You better not try to sell them off! Not like I'd make any money! Things are so cheap, they couldn't align two magnetized connectors. Nice! <laughs> oh yeah, you remember that dealer who asked about the emitters? After you left, he... <laughs> He leans over to me, and he says, Uh, w w what do you need these for, then? I am Groot. <laughs> yeah, like I'm turning the Milano into a dance club or something. Please refrain from creating this club of dance. Yeah, yeah, we all know how you feel about dancing. I am Groot. Well, what was I supposed to tell him? Uh, you know, I uh, need them to build uh, some ultrasonic lures so my team of ex-cons can trap a mystery creature in the most uh, legal place in the quadrant. You want to throw in a discount?
Mora? Up here, Peter. Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. It's one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done strategizing, feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Once we breach that force field, there's no going back. Your black market codes are gonna crack that Nova net, right? Yep. As soon as you enter them in your console. Bowser! Morgoth, be with you! Hey, Morgoth yourself! I am cool. Morgoth is a politeness thing? Katathian customs don't make no sense to me, bud. Guys! Our great leader ran away. Could you send him back? Peter Quill, the murderer still calls your name. Oh, sounds kinky. Uh, nope. So, Drax, excited to meet our buyer after we catch the monster? Of course. Lady Hellbender is a legendary warrior and a noble queen. And she's rich. That is not a prowess, simply a commercial fact. As long as she buys her monster, she doesn't need to be royalty. You are jealous of her status. No thanks! Being a queen means being born with a target on your back. Kind of like the one on yours. Ugh. <sighs> Hey, uh, Groot, did that escort job on Orga ever pan out? <coughs> what do you mean you never called her back? Don't know if you noticed, but we're flarkin' broke. <coughs> what? Wait, what kind of escort was that contract about? <coughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe I'd rather be broke. Not so sure about tooth cleaning tablets. Manual brushing is where it's at. Wonder if Drax was allowed to decorate his cell in the kiln. Probably not. She's only been here a few months, but her room's already decked out. Gamora. Can this not wait, Peter Quill? I am readying my body for battle. Uh, <laughs> you know we're supposed to capture this monster, right? Not kill it? Of course. But I suspect it will not go down without a fight. Cool it, muscles. Lady Hellbender ain't gonna buy damaged goods. I will aim to preserve the integrity of the beast as best I can. Good.
What is it? Dude, take five. We gotta talk about that Gamora thing. She's waiting for you in the cockpit. I already checked in on her. You know you're not subtle with all that staring, right? Subtlety is neither my strength nor my intent. Look, I know you're mad about being on her team for the mission, but could you at least try to get along? I doubt I would succeed. All good, buddy? I'm Groot. You know, I don't understand you, Groot, but I'm gonna assume you just said something super kind and thoughtful. <laughs> I am Groot. What did the tree say? No idea. Groot really needs to get these plants under control. Good old Milano. Engine parts from at least five different black markets. Ready now? Now? Now, now. If his majesty will do us the honor of taking his throne. All right. Okay, here we go. Rocket, Groot, Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. If we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Novanet still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the Assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the Betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor coats are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. Zero, four, five, one. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacor. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal coordinates and our ship's hard-coded serial into a local number generator. Info gets in, digits come out. Four of them. There. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Eh, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacor had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overhaul. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoff 9 than any illegally acquired.
by a salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Groot, Quell, Soda. Team Rocket's up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the Assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop site. The ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, Groot. Don't worry! Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. Thumper one, done. Laura, take care of my baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Oh, oh. can you imagine? I am Groot. What, the pink coop? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Everybody keep an eye out for any good scrap or components. I am Groot. Nah, it's totally safe. Now, can we please focus less on the toxic goo and more on all this cool war junk it's holding together? I am Groot. He is not a better shot than me. After we sell the monster, I say we head to nowhere. Do some gambling. I am Groot. <laughs> you? You can't bluff your way out of a plantain pot. Yep. Being here definitely feels a little weird. Yo, Quill, these coordinates are so reliable. How come we're the only ones out here trying to catch this thing? We're the only ones crazy enough. Peter Quill, in subordination, the assassin has become insufferable. You find something we could sell? Nah, just some old correspondence. You know how I like to brush up on galactic war history. Um, no? Don't think I've ever seen you read anything without pictures. I read plenty of non-picture stuff. Come on, Quill. We still got three more thumpers to place. Second one's this way. I'm assuming you have a map or something? Uh, okay. Guess you're taking the long way now? Just one- oh! You okay, Quill? Yeah, I think so. This, uh, pink resin stuff's definitely strong enough to hold this place together. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely, probably strong enough. We don't know what it looks like. Quill neglected to get that info while he was flirting on Contraxia. It'll look like a monster worth selling. And I wasn't flirting, I was drinking. Argument, Rodent. What is this omnipresent pink substance made of? You mean the ebrium based nano resin cluster foam? Never trust something with that many dashes in its name. Is it caustic? Not if it stays outside you. Just don't eat any, or get any in your eyes. I'm 
thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... pink goo. Ebrium-based nanoresin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. You know, I think I do sort of get it. Thousands of worlds fighting for some fleeting greater good. Oh, look! Yellow and blue. Looks like an old Novacore friggin'. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why do you even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so why here? You think it's to impress Gamora? Like, hey, Check out the serious intel I got from, you know, shady sources. Don't know if you noticed, Rocket, but people aren't exactly falling over themselves to hire us. Oh, I have noticed. If this job pans out, sure we'll get money, but also a rich new client. We need to impress Lady Hellbender with a monster she's interested in, not just any old critter. Which is why we should have gone after Fin Fang Foom. We won't impress no one if we're dead. Just imagine what kind of blasters the Shadari had to use to wreck some of these frigates. I am Groot. I'm not being insensitive. I'm curious. I'm kind of jealous. Novacore once wanted to cover entire planets in Novanet, just like this place. I am Groot. Hostile ones, I guess. I am Groot. Yeah, I wouldn't want the world mind picking and choosing. Most of my favorite planets would probably become jails. Okay! Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you know who joined us. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a, a swell guy. I hope you get that promotion, Rocket. Are you calling me a bootlicker? Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Maybe. Hey, can't a guy want to spend some quality time with his friends? Careful on that thing, Quill. You spot something out there? More blue and gold. More Novacore. Yeah, well, at least the dead ones can't arrest us. There's the mining rig. Any sign of our monster? Not yet. Safe to walk on, mostly. That's why green teams on the Milano. Heck of a lot more dangerous to fly around in here. I heard that. Whoa! Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me. All right. Hey, Gru. You think we could find pieces of the Trion shard in here? You never heard of the Tryon shard? 
pyramid of pure evil that corrupts everything it comes in contact with. Making things up. Name one time I ever made something up. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. Ah, shut up. Ask Gamora. Bet she's heard about the Tryon shard. Hey, Gamora! I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, come on. I know Thanos had his hands on it during the war. It's gotta be in here somewhere. Quill, tell- Ah, oh, where's Quill? What the hell is he still doing back there? I am Groot. Eh, it's not like we have a choice to wait for him. Star Lost got one of our thumpers, and I'm not walking all the way back there. How many of these ships did you personally destroy, Assassin? In this massive junkyard, filled with debris from both sides of the war. How do you expect me to answer that? Dishonestly. Well, you found the thing. I told you was there, but you didn't listen. A dead end. Ah, uh, the mythical void. Death's black terminal. I would rather be there with you. What? Drax, wrong kind of end. And it's not like you could have known, Rocket. Both ways were going in the same direction. Maybe to you. That's it. Walk of shame. <sighs> Of course he could know. I told him.
You done gloating? Oh, I am never done gloating. I am Groot. Yep, classic me. Watch your step, guys. This junk isn't as stable as we think. Oh, that is one big mushroom. Take that, brittle stuff. Ugh. I hate these ship-eating parasites. Flarkas would chew right through the Milano in two cycles. Another giant sheet of metal. Don't have to wait for me if you're in such a rush, Rocket. Of course we're waiting for it. You know how much work I put into those thumpers? Splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm good. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit used to be. Well, that's grim. Uh, yeah, try not to think about it. It's better not to wonder what happened to anyone working on these old wrecks. It was a long time ago anyways.
don't know, but he's twitching. Fucking Scott stain, Quill. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... Thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a crapped out Novacore missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. <laughs> 